Our main review this week is Pitfall, the main adventure on the SNES, a re-release of an old Atari classic. This is what it looked like back in 1982, and the original actually appears as a level in the new game. Pitfall 1994 style stars Harry Jr., son of the first Pitfall hero. His mission is to save his father, who's been kidnapped by an evil Mayan spirit. Here's the hail. This game was worth bringing back from the dead, but it still needs emergency surgery. The animation's outstanding, but there's only eight levels, and many of them look the same. The main sprite, Harry Jr., has incredibly fluid movements, and overall, the animation in the game's excellent. What you have to do here is jump on the crocodiles' heads and their lilies to make your way over the river. The sound's crisp and really adds to the enjoyment of the gameplay. One thing I have to say, though, is that once you've played this bit over and figured out what to do, you just won't want to play it again. It's not really a game you want to keep coming back to. Some of the puzzles in this game are rather tricky. Here, I'm trapped in an area, and to escape, I have to pull a sequence of levers. That's the first one. Just jump over here and go through here to find another lever which opens a trap door below. The first time you see this, it's really interesting and poses a challenge, but the second and third time, it's just a bore. It's got some good touches, but not enough interesting gameplay to make it a SNES classic. The sound is quite outstanding on this game. It gives you a real sense of actually being there. Indiana Jones, eat your heart out. This is action-packed stuff. And the scores. Pitfall, the Mayan adventure, gets an average three from the boys and a golden oldie four from the girls.